and fellow sewists, my name is Hannah and today on Minerva I'm going to talk to you about some beautiful Rose and Hubble cotton poplin fabrics. Now Rose and Hubble were established in 1922 so they certainly know a good thing or two about high quality fabrics. Today I have 30 different fabrics to show you, everything from classic cold polka dots to florals to novelty print, so let's get right into it. I've got a beautiful Rose and Hubble rosebud cotton poplin that I've made with a Butterick 6242 pattern. This was such a joy to sew with, it's so easy, it pleats beautifully, it washes beautifully, it irons really nicely, a real joy to sew with. Today also I'm wearing a me made two piece. This is a lovely ivory broadcloth cotton that we have on Minerva at the moment. It comes in both ivory and white and it is absolutely beautiful. I will tag that below as well. I mentioned today will be tagged below and if you create a Minerva account today you get discount off your next order and as if that wasn't incentive enough you can join our Minerva craft club and get 10% off for the first 12 months. So let's get looking at these beautiful cotton poplin fabrics. So first up we have this gorgeous lilac-y purple cotton poplin. This shade is actually called Lotus which I think is just a beautiful way to describe this colour. What's great about cotton poplin is because of its tight weave it's really great to embroider onto so there's so many different things you can do with cotton poplin. But I thought it would be really nice to make a nice 1940s style blouse with the Simplicity 8736 pattern. Now this actually has four different styles with it so it's really great one to have in your pattern stash. And I thought in particular the options where it's got the collar, it'd be really nice to add a little floral embroidery design. Really, really cute way to enhance your own creations. Now, who doesn't love polka dots? This is such a gorgeous, gorgeous polka dot. I really like that the polka dots are evenly distributed so it makes it nice and easy for when you're matching up your pattern pieces. I'd really like to make a nice cute little dress with this. The pattern that I thought would be great that we have on Minerva is the Simplicity 8591. Now this is a cute little 1960s style dress which is very reminiscent of Bridget Bardot in the 60s going on cute little jaunts in Paris. Now the pattern actually has three different styles, two of which have cute little ruffled sleeves and the third one is a sleeveless option that has a really cute sailor collar, really really sweet. And what's great about cotton poplin is it's so nice to work with that you know when you're creating a nice like full, full circle skirt and you're trying to attach all that a huge amount of fabric at the waistline and sometimes it gets a bit bulky but with the great thing about cotton poplin is it, even though it is medium weight so it'll drape nicely it doesn't create huge amounts of bulk so it's nice and easy to sew with. Next up we have this gorgeous royal blue star pattern. This is so beautiful, it's absolutely strewn with stars all over it, really really pretty. I think it will be perfect for both adult and kids wear. The pattern I'd love to pair this with is the Simplicity Artisan Dress, which comes with both an adult and kids wear size pattern, so that's just so cute. I love coordinating clothing. <laughs> I love the laid back nature of this style pattern. I think it would be a nice contrast with how vibrant this pattern is with a nice relaxed style. It would be perfect for day wear, for pottering around in the garden, or if you're anything like me, that as soon as you're eating or drinking, you presumably spill everything that you're consuming all down yourself. And you want to be able to just throw those gorgeous handmade items in the washing machine without having to worry about it. And that's the great thing with cotton poplin. It's durable, it's easy to wash, and it's always used in sportswear and shirting, so you know it's going to be long lasting. How fun is this leopard print? I absolutely love leopard print. To me, leopard print is classed as a neutral. It's always in fashion, it never goes out of style, and this colour is so fun. This is the ochre shade. It is so, so lovely. Reminds me of my punk days when I was a teenager. Not that I was a proper punk, I was too much of a geek. But this leopard print is so, so lovely. I'd love to pair this with almost anything because I love leopard print, but in all seriousness, I'd love to use the Soha 7 slacks because again I do like the idea of having a really vibrant cotton but pairing it with like a nice laid back style. I think poplin is nice and strong so these would be kind of trousers that you can wear again and again and let's not forget this pattern has pockets.
pen pattern is so fun and cool. I really, really like it. I'd love to pair this with the Quick Sew 4279 bag pattern. Now this has three different styles that will be really nice for everyday use, especially when you're nipping to the supermarket and you just can throw in your fruit and veg in your bag. It's nice to have a big roomy Mary Poppins size bag, I do feel, it's very useful. I could also see using this print to make cute little makeup bags, you know, to put like your cotton pads in and things like that. Really, really fun design. a really fun print from Rose and Hubble. This Skull and Roses is such a quirky cool design. I think it would be perfect to make some home accessories out of this cotton poplin. I thought it would be great to pair it with the Simplicity 8308 cushion cover pattern. It would make a great gift to give to someone. A little cushion in this print perhaps with some contrasting fringing or tassels and the great thing about cotton poplin is that it's water resistant so it makes for great homeware accessories. Another really fun print from Rose and Hubble. This sugar skull pattern is so gorgeous and vivid. Really, really beautiful, unusual design. I would love to make a nice skirt with this, but I think it would be nice to mix things up and perhaps pair it with the Quick Sew 4151 slipper pattern. How cool would that be to make some coordinating slippers for you and your loved ones? And cotton poplin is so durable, so it would be great for the kind of cozy wearable project that you're gonna wear again and again. Okay, as a cat mum of two, this pattern really speaks to me. This is such an adorable, unique pattern, and I really love this gorgeous jade colour. It's really, really gorgeous. So bright and such an unusual colour as well. Um, I may be biased being a cat lover, but I just had to pair this with the Quick Sew 3517 pattern. Now this has a whopping four pieces for your furry friend. A lead, a harness, a bed, and most importantly, to me, a pet carrier. Because of the longevity of cotton poplin, it would be great to make little accessories for your furry friends in this design. So why not treat your little furry friend to some coordinating accessories? And you know, you could make yourself some matching slippers, a matching top. It would be great to coordinate with not only your loved ones, but your loved ones that have four legs. Rainbows and unicorns, how can you not smile when you see this print? This is such a lovely design. I could see making some cute little kids wear items with this pattern, but what I thought would make a nice contrast is to pair this with the Simplicity 8800 loungewear pattern. Now this has five different styles to choose from and would make some really cozy pajamas, as cotton poplin is so lovely and comfy and nice and breathable to be worn at bedtime. Another really adorable novelty print from Rose and Hubble. These little sheep are so cute. They're so happy. It's such a vibrant, gorgeous print. I really, really love it. I think it'd be nice to make myself some pyjamas in this print and perhaps force my husband to wear some coordinating ones. But I thought this print would be really lovely for some baby clothing. The new look 6568 has four different options. My favourite is the cute little romper. And again, because cotton poplin is so durable, it would be perfect for little ones who are always tumbling around. Another really, really cute animal print design from Rose and Hubble. This penguin pattern is so lovely. It has little baby penguins and adult penguins all over it. Really, really lovely. This jade colour is also so, so pretty. I think this would work perfectly with the Kids Birder 9747 pyjama pattern. This is a great pattern for beginners and has four different pattern styles and ranges from ages 3 to 15. Cotton poplin is great for everyday wear and is low maintenance both to sew with and to wash and iron more importantly. Here we have a striking koi fish print with beautiful blossom flowers.
This is such a vibrant, beautiful print and would work really well with the Tilly and the Buttons indigo smock pattern, which can be used as either a dress or as a cute smock top. I really love the cute little ruffle detail on that indigo smock and I think the contrast of the vivid koi fish with this silhouette would be a great match. And because cotton poplin is so easy to sew with, it's great to pair it with patterns that are suitable for beginners. It's so nice and easy to, and simple to sew with. Who doesn't love little bumblebees? This is such a gorgeous classic print. Really pretty. This would be perfect perhaps some cushion covers or maybe even some oven gloves. But I thought it would be great to pair this cotton poplin with the men's quick sew 3884 shorts, which has two different styles with or without pockets. Obviously we're going to go with the pocket option. Cotton poplin is used for a lot of sportswear so this would be a great match for the shorts pattern for a nice little trip to the beach or perhaps even a good old barbecue. Here I have this glorious toucan print fabric with beautiful tropical flowers. This print is so bright and cheerful. I would like to pair this with the Simplicity 8390 easy to sew lounge pants. This pattern is suitable for both girls and ladies, so it's a great little treat for you and a loved one. As cotton poplin is so comfy, loungewear is always a perfect option to sew with. Here I have another stunning tropical print from Rose and Hubble. This is such a gorgeous vibrant print and would work really nicely with the New Look 6197 shirt pattern, which has styles for both men and women. The great thing about cotton poplin is that it's so crisp and breathable that it's a really nice fabric to wear in warmer weather. So why not whip up some coordinating shirts for you and your friends? Continuing the tropical theme, we have this beautiful novelty print from Rose and Hubble which has glorious parrots and hummingbirds among some beautiful tropical flowers. I could see this working really well with a cute little vintage inspired two-piece, but I thought it would be fun to pair this with the Girls Butterick 3860 pattern. This has five different styles, so two dresses, a top, trousers and shorts, so a really great pattern to have in your stash. One of my favourites out of the Rose and Hubble range is this beautiful lemon print. It's such a gorgeous print which has jasmine-like flowers strewn throughout the lemons. Really pretty. This would work fabulously with the McCall 7937 pattern, which is a cute pattern with five different styles. This would be so nice to use with the lemon print. Imagine the cute little frills on those trousers and the little bralette top. So, so beautiful to wear in spring and summer. Another adorable fruit cotton poplin. This cherry print is so beautiful and fun. This would make for a really pretty blouse. I've selected the Simplicity 880 blouse pattern, which has four different styles that would be really cute to match with this cherry print. The detailing around the sleeves and bust line would be really easy to do with this cotton poplin as it's such a dream to work with, really easy to manipulate. And it's not too bulky, so it'll show the details really beautifully. Continuing our vibrant theme, I have this adorable sunflower print. You cannot help but smile when you see this print. It's so pretty. I would love to pair this with the Simplicity 1221 apron pattern. It has four different styles, which are so pretty. Aprons make for great day-to-day -day wear, especially when you're fond of crafting. If you're anything like me, you're always covered in bits of thread or splashes of food. It's a great way to utilise really gorgeous prints that you can wear day to day. Plus each pattern has a pocket and we all know we love pockets.
Next up I have this stunning pink tropical floral print cotton poppin from Rose and Hubble. This is such a vibrant print that would make for an excellent little bralette. I would like to pair this with the Simplicity 1426 bralette style pattern which is inspired by the 1950s and it has five different styles that would be so lovely for little trips to the seaside. And because cotton poplin is so nice and durable it's perfect for lingerie style attire. Here I have this really beautiful, unusual pink floral and almost golden leaf cotton poplin from Rose and Hubble. This is such a gorgeous print, really unusual and vivid. I think this would work really well with the cashmere at Hollyoak maxi dress and skirt. I can imagine myself swishing around in that skirt and dress as it's such a lovely pattern and would really show off this print. And it would make for great glamorous day-to-day -day wear because cotton poplin is so comfy and breathable to wear. Oh how I love florals and this one is no exception. This is such a pretty print. It reminds me of tulips, really gorgeous. This would work really well with the Vogue 8996 pattern which is a great one for beginners. And as I said, cotton poplin is a joy to sew with, really easy to manage and most importantly it's durable. So anything you make with cotton poplin will be made to last. And did I mention that this pattern has pockets? This poppy print is so beautiful. I like that it has both the full open flower and the bud. It's a really unusual floral print and it's great for people that normally stay clear of florals because they do tend to be a little bit twee. This is a really nice modern lovely print. I would like to see this paired with the Vogue 9075 pattern. This has two styles, a dress and a jumpsuit and I would love to make the jumpsuit option. A really beautiful, lovely silhouette which would be really nice to wear in this comfortable cotton poplin. Here I have a really beautiful feather print cotton poplin from Rose and Hubble. This is such a dreamy print. If you follow me on Minerva, you probably know that I absolutely love vintage style clothing. So I'm probably being a little bit biased here, but I'd love to see this paired with the vintage Vogue 1172 dress pattern. It has a gloriously full skirt that would be such, such a beautiful pairing with this feather print. And because of the medium weight of this fabric, it would create a really beautiful, nice drape and wouldn't weigh down on the waistline. This wildflower pattern is so dreamy, it has such a gorgeous array of flowers and leaves. It's like you're stepping into a meadow when you look at this, it's so lovely. I think this would be dreamy to pair with the Style Arc Montana dress. It's a really lovely laid back smock style dress, it's a great one for beginners. I could also see using this print to make some lovely pillowcases with nice little ruffles on. And what's great about cotton poplin is that you can use it for a wide variety of things, so don't just keep it retained for making clothing, you can make anything with it, like pillowcases, home accessories, all sorts. Some more beautiful floral prints from Rose and Hubble. This is such a gorgeous, lovely floral print. It has so many different facets to it. I love the range of colours, everything from ochre to pink. I think this would make for a really nice blouse, so I'd like to see this paired with the Simplicity 8839 blouse pattern, which has four different styles. It would be a really great pattern to show off this print to its fullest. I especially love option A on that pattern. I really need to treat myself to it as I'm desperate to try it out. So if you do get it, please do tag me on it because I'm really eager to see what it looks like.
Next up I have this really beautiful floral print from Rose and Hubble. This is, has such a pretty array of florals on it, really really striking. I think this would work superbly with the Simplicity 1563 loungewear pattern. This pattern has five different styles and it's suitable for both men and women. So it would make for a great gift for someone or perhaps even a gift to yourself. And as cotton poplin is water resistant, it's perfect for loungewear or for people like me who consistently spill food and drink on themselves. Next up I have this beautiful, lovely denim floral print. It's such a gorgeous floral print. It would make for a perfect pairing with the Fibre Mood shirt dress for girls. It has two different options, both long and short versions, and I have noted it does have pockets. This pattern is suitable for ages 4 to 14 and would be a really great addition for a young girl's wardrobe. Really pretty pattern and print and the flowers are nice and dense so it's not overly girly so suitable for older girls as well. Such a really nice unusual print. Okra floral print from Rose and Hubble is so unusual, a really flattering colour for everybody. This isn't a common one for florals, a nice okra, I think it's nice and unusual. I think this would pair really nicely with the new look 6659 skirt pattern. This pattern has two different styles, both knee and full length, but what I thought would be really beautiful for this is the pleating detail. Cotton poplin is so easy to sew with, so it will be really nice to use that kind of detailing and such a breeze to do. Last but by no means least, this beautiful navy cotton poplin from Rose and Hubble is such a gorgeous, beautiful floral pattern. It has bursts of floral pink bouquets, really, really classic print. I'd love to pair this with the Butterick 6318 style pattern. It has two different styles and is such a cute little dress that is a really nice classical silhouette. Thank you so much for watching this Rose and Hubble cotton poplin video today. I'm really very excited to see what wonderful inspiring things the Minerva community will create out of these cotton poplins. Please don't hesitate to comment below and tag me in any of your creations that you make inspired by this video. And don't forget to join our Minerva community, it's free and it's a great way to get inspired by fellow creatives and get free advice. Thank you so much.